My name is Michael Brunn. I'm a music producer, DJ, and artist from Puerto Prince. I decided to call the album Local, which means local in Haitian Creole. Throughout my life, I'd heard all kinds of amazing music in Haiti, around Haiti, in the different regions and different cities. I wanted to make something that was representative of the entire island. Doing the bio tour, going to all these different cities, bringing Haitian culture to all these different places. Bio! Bio! It made me understand that I had a responsibility as an artist from Haiti to put my footprint out into the world and to share all these beautiful things. Latin music, African music, Caribbean music has never been as big as it is now. The world is really more connected than it's ever been. So to have a project like this from Haiti, it's really exciting because I feel like this is the moment to do it. Going on tour with Jay Balvin and seeing how he was able to create something really unique not just a purely Latin project, but a world project. And then seeing the same thing with Mr. Easy, with what he was doing. Those few months, just moving around and, and doing shows and making music together with those guys, really taught me a lot. Yeah, that's good. You all gotta work, man. You all gotta work. I grew up so much as an artist because I learned a lot more about what I want to say, the kinds of things that I want to leave behind with my work and the legacy that I create. Because I don't want to be somebody that just comes in and then disappears. Like I really want to have something substantial. And I think that my responsibility as a Haitian artist to have been able to work together with so many people from around the world, it puts me in a position to really fight for the culture and put it out there and, and hopefully give an opportunity to so many other artists to come out and, and do their thing too. There are so many artists that I worked with on this project. Everybody including Jay Perry, Mika Ben, Baki, all artists who are on the bio tour. And then also artists that I've worked with in the past like Belo and some legends as well like Bookman Experience, Eddie Francois. Also, La Difficile de Petronville that I sampled on one of the songs that we're doing. But then also on the flip side, I wanted to work with a few international artists that I felt understood the message of this project and that just really connected with it. So having, for example, Mr. Easy, Adekun Negold, both from Nigeria, Major Laser and Diplo, they were very supportive since day one. It's very diverse, there's a lot of different sounds, some are more jazzy, some are more street sounds, some are more spiritual. That all kind of represents what my music taste is and I think Hades as a whole. I really hope that with this project and this album, when people listen to it, they feel how passionate I was about this whole thing. Because truly, to get to do this was like a dream come true. Being able to work with so many legends across the board, it felt like maybe I wouldn't have a chance to do this in the future. And so I wanted to really have something that I could be proud of. I'm excited because I, I think you'll feel the passion. I think you'll, you'll feel the culture in this. You'll feel how so many people put their best word forward. I hope it changes perspectives of what you might think Katie's about.